the embattled advocacy group ACORN is ordering an independent investigation after two employees were caught on tape uh, appearing to give illegal advice to a couple posing as a prostitute and a pimp. Now another undercover video has surfaced. This one shows a worker talking about prostitution and murder, but the worker on the tape says it's not what it seems, a claim that's in, uh, backed up in part by police reports. Let's go to CNN's Abby Boudreau of our Special Investigations Unit. Uh, Abby, uh, what's on this new tape? Well, this, this new tape is very similar to many of the other ones. This couple spent the summer going around the country posing as a pimp and a prostitute, dropping in on Acorn housing offices in various cities, asking for help and setting up a fictitious brothel. Now we have tape number four, some calling it the strangest of the bunch. This undercover sting was shot in San Bernardino, California. Same storyline as the other three videos. The filmmakers pose as a pimp and a prostitute, asking for Acorn's help to set up a brothel to fund a future political campaign. The Acorn worker responds by claiming that she, too, once ran a prostitution service, though now she says she was just playing games with the filmmakers. I ran a service. Really? Yeah. Well, Heidi Fleiss is my hero. <laughs> I understand, and believe me, I do know, because I used to employ girls that, that, that would do this because they didn't care. I had people, women, that would take care of every little wish, you know, every fantasy. And the acorn worker doesn't stop there. She also tells the pair she killed her ex-husband in self-defense. I shot him. I shot him in self-defense? Yeah. And then I just picked up the gun and said, fuck you. And I shot him. And he died right there. However, the San Bernardino Police Department looked into the woman's claim to be a killer and issued this statement, quote, the claims do not appear to be factual. Investigators have been in contact with the involved parties known former husbands who are alive and well. The pair who shot this and the other videos, James O'Keefe and Hannah Giles, are both conservative activists and don't try to hide the fact that they're on a mission to take down ACORN a group that's been the subject of serious allegations of corruption and election fraud. ACORN is fighting back just as hard. It provided CNN with a sworn statement from the woman in the most recent video where she tries to explain herself. She says, quote, I told them several times that ACORN would not support what they were doing in any way. The woman also denies ever having run a call girl service, saying, quote, I felt like they were playing games with me, so I proceeded to play games with them. The woman in the video that you just saw says she had no idea that she was being taped. We have reached out to her at this point. We're hoping to speak with her very soon. Wolf. Have you been able, Abby, to speak with these two filmmakers? Yeah, we have been trying to talk to them from the very beginning, but they have not returned repeated calls from CNN. Also, we want to reiterate that these videos were edited together. We have not seen the unedited version. And, Wolf, it's also important to note at least four of the workers from the previous tapes have been fired from their jobs. Uh, Acorn announced just today, Wolf, that it's putting a hold on new hires and retraining its workers so they don't make the same kinds of mistakes we've seen over the past few days.